All right, so I know you guys are probably curious as to how the plants in the, in the new tank are gonna be getting nutrients and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I do in order for those plants to get fed since they're planted straight into sand. Um, sand doesn't have any nutritional value whatsoever. So um, yeah, basically what I do is I cut down my florist root tabs into tiny little pieces and just kind of put those all over the place like right next to the roots and stuff that way they have immediate nutrients uh, to hurry up and get them started so let me show you what I'm working with alright so basically I take one of these florist root tabs right here and I cut them up into these little chunks that you see here and then I take my tweezers and plant them right next to the roots in the tank so Let's go ahead and do that now. All right, so this is usually what I do when I have a substrate that is inert and it has zero nutrients. You need to feed the roots, so I go ahead and I grab these little cut up root tabs that I just showed you and I plant them as close to the roots as I can. That way that plant has some immediate food. My boy Blue's up here checking out what's going on. By the way, this guy also has a swimming condition. I don't know if I've ever met, uh, mentioned that, but he uh, he's definitely not a very good swimmer, that's for sure. Alright guys, that's it. That's basically what I do when I have an inert substrate and my plants are root feeders. I basically just plant uh, root tabs right next to the, the roots. So it's, it's really that simple. So yeah, if you haven't noticed, I put some Anubius up here in the middle. I felt like the middle area was just a little too bare, so I put an Anubius Nana there. Um, that one did start out as a um, immersed Anubius like uh, grown above water, but it, uh, it has taken very well to the underwater conditions. I mean, it is Anubius, it's pretty much bulletproof. Um, it was getting a little bit of algae there on the leaves, but it's pretty much went away. I'm not sure if you guys can see that or not. It's pretty much gone, but the tank is looking really good. I'm actually really surprised with how well this tank looks. Um, I don't know what it is about that sand and I put a white background on it. It looks really, really nice. If you're uh, curious about my lighting, I'm using a 11 inch Nikru LED. Um, it puts off a pretty good amount of light to be completely honest with you. But anyways, if you guys are new to my channel, please subscribe and I'll catch you guys on the next video.